two, three, four. Hi, my name is Nicolina, and I am also hiking the Appalachian Trail. I'm from the city of Smiles, Aarhus, in Denmark, which is also where I study psychology. Sounds familiar? That's where I met this guy. I eat a lot of carrots and hummus and sweets, just food in general, and drink lots of coffee. I love movies, home knit socks, go more in Denmark, and of course, hiking. I remember coming back home from two months in South America and asking my parents why on earth they had never taken me and my younger sisters out on a long hike. I had just been out in breathtakingly beautiful nature and I was in love with that way of exploring. She told me that there was no way that I would have agreed to such a trip in my teens. But for me, it took that one experience to fall in love. Many people can agree on nature having the power to heal. That was what drove me to Spain to walk the Camino de Santiago. But what really filled my entire body with joy and happiness was the people I met along the way. There is this unwritten rule on the Camino that once you reach Santiago, you stay there for at least a couple of days to have the opportunity to see everyone you've met and congratulate them. I believe in the power of people. And the people I hiked with and met along the Camino Santiago were the people that made my journey incredible. I came to reflect, stretch my legs and my mind, but crossed paths with a traveling shit show that had Albergues calling in advance just to let the people know that we were coming. In the end, that was exactly what I needed, a traveling shit show and the most kind-hearted adventurous people I have ever met. So, why am I hiking the Appalachian Trail, you might ask? First of all, because it's out there to be hiked. Second of all, because I felt what it did to me and the people I met in Spain. But also to challenge myself and feel like I can accomplish anything I put my mind to. And last but not least, to have the freedom and opportunity to do so and share that experience with the person I love the most. Who actually really knows what waits for me and Rooney on the Appalachian Trail? Besides a lot of miles, cold rainy encounters and challenges you can't really prepare yourself 100% for. But one thing is sure, that we will have the best story to tell when we come back. What's up, Hiker Trash? Thank you for watching this video and making it all the way to the end. Now you should have quite a good idea of who Nicolina is as well, other than just my 2D girlfriend who exists primarily on a screen. She also has feelings and thoughts and stuff like that. I do. And this is the end of the video. So what I'm going to do here is I just wanted to pluck some things because a lot of you guys have been asking if I have an Instagram. And I do have an Instagram, and the name will be in the description. somewhere here, and also down in yeah. the description. And also, usually I put it as the first comment, so then when you scroll down, that's the first thing you see. Thank you for being here. Thank you for subscribing to the challenge. <laughs> you put it in my head. Thank you for being here, and thank you for subscribing to the channel. 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 Challenge. Challenge. Um. <laughs> 375 people are now subscribed uh, to the Trail Army, the yeah. best army on YouTube. Don't look that up. Uh, and it's insane. It's really great. And I can't wait to show you guys uh, all of my hiking adventures in the future. This coming week, we will be going on a shakedown hike mm -hmm. uh, of 80 kilometers, which is approximately 50 miles yeah. um, here in Denmark, which we will be vlogging. So that will be up next week. So subscribe to keep tuned on our videos and remember to hit the bell button if you want to be notified and that's it thank you for watching and happy hiking everyone yeah happy hiking